So you guys may already know that if you make an adjustment on your mix console specifically and you want to undo it, in Cubase we use Option Z or Alt Z if you're on a PC. If you want to redo it, then it's Option Shift Z. But there are times when you may have made a lot of adjustments to your mix console and maybe you've gone too far down the rabbit hole and you want to just reset everything to where things were when you started out at a certain point. Well, this is where the Mixer History tab really comes in handy. So with my Mixer open here, let's come over to the left and access the History tab. Now, the cool thing is, is you'll see that any adjustment that I make to this mix console is also recorded in the history tab. This also goes for any adjustment I make to plugins. So all of these moves I'm making on this EQ are also tracked. Now, if I wanted to recall where things were at on this mix console before I made all of these adjustments, I could, of course, option Z, undo all of these changes, or I could just click on a certain action in this history and jump to it automatically. And of course, any of these actions can be redone. We just click wherever we need to go on the history tab. Really cool and useful feature in Cubase.